In this video, we're going to discuss trailer-mounted radar speed monitors, why they are used, and how to choose which system is right for you. Trailer mount radars are portable and are mainly used by police departments and construction zones. The objective of trailer mount radars are to help calm traffic and slow down speed violators. Radars remind drivers of the speed limit and to check their own speed. If you're considering a trailer mount radar, we have six options to choose from. All models are equipped with two violator alert features. One is the overspeeding violator flashing alert, which indicates the driver is speeding by the digits flashing. And the other is the overspeed blanking violator alert. This just means that the screen goes blank, which is to prevent drivers from attempting to drag race. So now I'm going to walk you through the comparison chart to help you determine which system may be right for you. These first three radars are heavy duty trailers which are more durable and tend to have a longer lifespan. Since they are heavy duty, they are equipped with a swivel jack that easily raise, raises and lowers the trailer to help level it. All three of these have diamond grade signs, which makes the reflection of the sign greater. The only difference in these three is this model, the, the 2000 R18, has a winch that folds the radar and sign down and it has a see-through trailer design. The Model 2002 R20 is a more compact design and the 2012 RR18 is the only trailer that offers a 360 degree rotation. All three of these trailer mount radars would be a better suited for interstates or highways where there is heavy traffic and greater speeds. Our next three trailer mount radars are lightweight and are equipped with a sliding jack instead of a swivel jack. If you're looking for a more cost effective system, these three are your better options. They also come with an engineering grade sign, which is just a plain sign. This makes these trailer mount radars better suited for county and city roads where the amount of traffic and speed limit are lower. The differences between these last three are the solar watts, the character height, and the battery amps. The LT ER18 and the LT ER16 both have solar watts of 40, while the LT ER10 has a solar watt of 20. All three differ in the character height. Character height is the difference between the top of the digit and the bottom of the digit. LTR18 has a character height of 18, LTER16 has a character height of 16, and the LTER10 has a character height of 10 inches. If you are environmentally conscious, the LTER10 was built with you in mind. It is designed to use less energy without compensating for quality or features. It has a 20 watt solar with only 10 inch character height and only an 18 amp battery. This model has a third violator alert feature that the other models do not have. This model is equipped with an LED strobe light violation alert that draws the driver's attention to the speeding violation. It is located in between the two digits right here. Each model has options available for them including KPH, Bluetooth for wireless downloading of traffic stats, motion alarm, and much more. Once you find the model that's right for you, click to go to its products page. Scroll to the bottom of the page till you see options. Click on options and there you'll find all the available features for that model. Thank you for watching this video on our trailer mount radar speed monitors. If you need anything else, please contact one of our dealers by clicking on the dealer tab on the website or contact k, &K Systems directly at 888-414-3003.